Guys, please make sure you stay until the end. One common mistake that people often make can cost you thousands of dollars in repairs, parts, diagnostics that you may actually not even need. Stay with us, we'll explain what we're talking about. Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you having a Chevy Tahoe or Chevy Suburban. That generation here from year 2000 and uh, 14 to year 2020. If you guys have one of those, if you need to find where the fuses and the relays for the infotainment screen, also known as infotainment display or also known as just infotainment fuses, relays, where they're located, where you can uh, find them, where you can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays at a good price, quick shipping that way do not waste money and time well guys it's always a good idea to test fuses and realize all that will be covered absolutely free for your convenience please make sure it's done till the end so before we start guys let us tell you a little bit about us every single car we get here in the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos we take them guys completely apart we show you how to fix engines transmissions bodywork guys engine codes transmission codes fuses relays uh, as well guys why we do all that because our mission in the shop is to save as much money as we can all we need in return please subscribe to the channel like the video that way we can keep making these free videos guys we have more than 15,000 free repair videos on our YouTube channels that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs and if you guys need to buy any parts choose at a good price quick shipping that way do not waste money and time we'll put the link in the description of the video below for your convenience please check it out so guys the infotainment fuses and relays where you can expect to find them we will demonstrate on this generation Chevy Tahoe Chevy Suburban right here now guys both vehicles are built on the same platform the only difference practically the Suburban is longer but it should apply to both now quick reminder most owners do not know how many different fuse boxes are hidden all over that SUV that's why we made a very helpful video on our YouTube channel about fuse box, fuse box location on Chevy Tahoe and Chevy Suburban here what you need to check guys okay we need to open the passenger door then on the side of the dash here you have one cover that cover needs to be pried open once you guys open that cover you're going to find a fuse box with a layout like this one here but before we continue let's explain quickly why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays it is guys very important to test fuses and relays on those fuses you cannot clearly see if they're burnt or not especially you can see in the jk's fuses as well and if you guys assume okay you, let's say you remove a fuse you look at it and you assume guys that it's uh, actually a, a good fuse but it's actually a bad fuse sometimes you cannot clearly see that what can easily happen guys at that point uh, you can uh, uh, put the bad fuse in and you start replacing parts and tools that you don't need to so you lose your time you lose your money to fix a problem that doesn't exist when all we had to do is test the fuse and replace it we'll put a link to a special video that will teach you how to test fuses how to check relays very easily as well guys so uh, check it out it will be in the description of the video below so guys the infotainment fuses and relays where you can find them first okay let's zoom in so you can clearly guys okay see everything here and by zooming in we can see in a detailed view all the fuses so if you come guys okay in that row of fuses right here now okay this is fuse 28 27 26 check that fuse 26 that's a double uh, double fuse 10 amp fuse that's known as micro 3 fuse it's really hard to find or really overpressed so we'll put a link in the description of the video below where you can get it from but that's the fuse that you will need to check what about relay you don't have a relay that fuse is the only thing that you need to check it's known as a relay fuse so if you have problems with the infotainment system that's the one that you guys need to check on your chevy tahoe and chevy suburban so guys i want to show you now something okay check this thing out you have all different kinds of fuses fuses relays circuit breakers something that could be really hard to find and if you're in the middle of nowhere you don't have replacement one you may end up being stuck guys in the middle of nowhere or they can be seriously overpriced so what we do we usually buy some spare ones we put in the glove box for a peace of mind we'll put the link in the description of the video below where you can get them at a good price quick shipping that way you do not waste money and time hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching and see you guys next time